after the first 14 games are on the road, Ole Miss returns home to host the Ole Miss Classic. The first opponent for the Rebels, one of the best teams out of the Southland Conference, the Southeastern Louisiana Lady Lions. The starting pitcher for the home opener, it's the senior McKinnon Clee Thermos. What can we expect to see out of McKinnon in the circle? Well, she leads the team in wins, ERA, and innings pitch. She's going to throw in the upper 60s. She's got a rise, drop, and a change. And I've been told that uh, mentally she's got her head on straight this year and ready to rock and roll it for Ole Miss. This is flipped in the air towards shallow left field and a diving catch is made by the shortstop, Ryan Starr. Hardy has thrown a career high eight innings earlier this season, did that against Nevada. Ground ball to short, Ryan Starr over to first. Nice scoop by Paige Smith. It is actually Sarah Blanchard. Blanchard is in the circle, senior out of Metairie, Louisiana. Runner on the move, throw down to second base, ends up in center field. Pone with their fifth stolen base of the season, stands at third base. Jamie McKay steps in. Runner on the move to second base. We got a runner in a jam, and the pickoff move, it is not there to run across for Ole Miss. Here she is on the move again. This time the throw is on target. Chloe McGee caught it and applied the tag. McKay is thrown out at second base for the final out of the inning. Entering today, and here she will ground out to Clee Thermos to begin the third in stolen bases this season. There's a little flair. There's the first base hit of the game for Southeastern. It's a one-out single for McGee. Fly ball, left field, it is caught. Watson makes the catch for the second out of the inning. Get out into the circle. Three, two, what a catch made at third base by Rummel. They can get a sense within the first hour what kind of team they're gonna have chemistry-wise. Here's a base hit, first of the night for the Rebels. There's too much speed on the bases to be able to turn two. That's past the catcher, Krolchak will have a play at the plate and sliding in safely. It's Thompson, it's a 2-0 Ole Miss lead. This is drilled to left field and it gets all the way to the wall. Maddie Watson. With a stand up, one out double, the Lady Lions will have the tying run coming to the plates. Keeping these speedy hitters off the bases. What a way to secure a victory for the Rebels. A diving catch by Jamie McKay wraps up an Ole Miss win in their home opener.